Hi everyone, how's it going? Um, so I'm super excited. I haven't done a video in quite a while. Um, good news, I just recently moved. Me and my husband bought my our first house. So I'm super excited. Um, and so I had gotten my scrapbook room together really fast because we just moved in November. And um, if you don't know, my scrapbook room was pretty huge. So... <laughs> Uh, or at least a decent size and so it took me a while to get everything organized and where I needed it to be and so uh, anyways aside from that um, I have four back-to-back -back videos because um, I decided well you know with houses being so expensive um, I, d I didn't really have any money for Christmas and so I decided one thing I would do for my siblings is to um, make a 2020 recap for them and so um, that's what I did with this these albums so before I show you the album of course I'm going to show you the paper pad that I used and um, today is using the crystal blues um, mind you I think I got these right whew, I want to say maybe two or three months ago and they've just been sitting in my stash I mean probably even longer um, but this collection is so beautiful. I honestly forgot that I had it and then when I unpacked everything I saw like a whole stack of brand new papers. So um, almost every album you'll be seeing in this, these next few videos is a brand new paper stack. So these ones are really beautiful with um, kind of like a frosty Christmas kind of, um, you know, album. And so uh, anyways, let's go ahead and get started. So uh, the cover is um, a seven and three quarters, oops, seven and three quarters by eight, and the inside pages are seven uh, by seven and a half. So it's a fairly large album, um, but definitely worth it. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at the cover. I decided to um, kind of make it a little bit busier, you know, bring out some of the gold and some of the uh, colors that were in the inside of the album. Um, and then I use the this paper there wasn't another one in the paper pad because I used them both but um, This gold leaf paper is just so gorgeous. And then for my spine. I have this fun little um, Changeable flippable sequin paper or sequin uh, uh, Material and then in the back this is what the cover looked like before I covered it and just all around plain beautiful and then um, here is uh, the side view, definitely a lot of pop dots, so uh, this might be a little bit longer video because um, I'll try, I mean, I haven't done one in a while, but I'm going to try and explain everything that I did. So, um, of course, you know me, I'm obsessed with my thickers. I had one here, um, this is just, um, I have a lot of these ones actually, so I used that one in the front and then um, I, I, I forced myself to use my Cricut because, uh, you know, I'm trying to learn it more and uh, and all that and so anyways for this first page um, I and these are already filled with photos because um, you know like I said it's their 2020 recap so um, anyways I know this one is from the winter wonderland cartridge I know that because I searched it I love their images for winter pictures and so uh, basically some of the white papers that you'll see in the background are embossed and then um, this one is another little flap added the word happy to it and then um yeah I just tried to go out of my element a little bit more and you know decorate as best I could um because all my albums are always just <laughs> you know no no photos in there so uh these ones you'll see they have a lot of flaps in them because I wanted to add as much pictures as I could and so um here is this page um since some of the photos are taken in the summer or you know different different times throughout the year um, I decided to put them on papers that weren't didn't really have a snowy background so this one has like polka dots <clears throat> and it just says all smiles my nephew and my sister this this sister that I'm giving it to she actually has two sets of twins and then two older boys so she has six kids all together and these are her older twins and these are her younger twins so um, I loved working on this album because I just love looking back on all the photos that we had but anyways uh, this ornament was part of the collection in the page, and I just free cut that. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is a little scratchy. It's been, I've been coughing up a storm this morning because it's been so dry. But anyways, um, here's a picture of my sister and her husband with their oldest son. 
and my niece and I did cut this frame out and layered it with gold and blue I don't know if you can tell but um the pages are I did do them in baby blue but I added a lot of dark blue and gold accents just to match the cover so uh this one's um super fun it's a little pocket here on the side with two photos and then um when we open it up here's a spot for more photos and here and here and I actually text a lot of them and ask them to send me some of their favorite pictures and then I added just the rest of <laughs> that were in my collection because I'm kind of like the photographer of the family so um, I had a lot of pictures to share with them too and so um, this one's one of my favorites of my um, nephew and his dad and it was their birthday so I just added a little thicker's um, birthday foam sticker here and then up here we have um, the word cutie and a lot of these I couldn't find um, shadows to. That's the only thing I don't like about the, the Cricut right now is I'm trying to figure out how to find shadows for things. It's, you know, like the backgrounds. And so anyways, I did the best with what I could. And so uh, here is one of the babies. When we open it up, I decided to have a page for mom and dad here. Aren't they such a good looking couple? I love it. And so um, anyways, and then here is another one of these flip ups. It's just a triple flip page and I just love how it was able to let me add a lot of photos without a lot of bulk so um, even though there is a lot of po um, pop dots in here it's definitely it lays flat and and I did my best to not have anything <laughs> you know scrape against another page because of how much details there was but anyways Here's the word soulmate with my sister and her, my brother-in-law there. And then my nephew, he graduated this year, which we were also proud of. You know, it's a hard thing to do during COVID. And then um, more pictures of my nephews. She has uh, five boys and one girl. <laughs> and then um, here are more pictures in here. This is a little pocket. I won't pull them all the way out, but um, anyways. And then here is another... This page, again, has another little flap on it. So this is Joy. And my nephew was so excited. He got a little Nintendo for his birthday. And that face, I'm just going to have to do a close-up because it's my favorite picture of him. It's just true joy in every sense of the word. And so, um, anyways, um, so when we open this flap over here, there's more pictures right here. And then uh, here's another cute photo of the oldest and the youngest sleeping exactly the same. <laughs> It was so cute. And that was taken at the park when we went this summer. And then um, this is another fun one. It's actually a magnet on this side of the uh, snow angel. And then when we open it up, you get this um, beautiful layout of some extra pictures. Um, and so the page serves as a decorative page, but definitely um, functional. And then this one, oh my gosh, <laughs> we actually just did these photos um this sunday this past sunday and i had to print it out real quick and add it into the album as a 2020 wrap-up and so this photo i actually took in my garage believe it or not <laughs> um i my sister picked out the background i bought it and uh you know we just set up the studio lights and everything and this is my favorite photo of their family from this year so i decided to put it in the back because Oh, it was the most cherished photo I, have, I will have of them. And so anyways, uh, that's the album. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really enjoyed making it and I'm so proud to show you guys. So on to the next video and we will see you next time. Bye.